Wear the Gown is sponsored by CHI St. Vincent. Well, we are six months into this pandemic and it's still a stressful time for everybody. But how does that stress affect your body and your health, specifically your heart? A Craig O'Neill shares more on how you can keep that stress down in this week's Wear the Gown. You've heard of a shade tree mechanic? We have a shade tree cardiologist, Dr. Tom Wallace. A normal heart rate's about 60 to 100 beats a minute, and we like to see a nice normal pattern. But when the stress builds up, that all changes. If your resting heart rate is just elevated more than normal, that could be a sign. We all don't have the equipment to constantly measure that accurately every day. So there are messages, though, that your body sends. The sensation of feeling flushed or chest pressure or chest heaviness, feeling short of breath when you really shouldn't be short of breath. And there are emotional messages, too. Irritability and agitation, saying things you don't want to say, firing off too quickly. The heart races, blood pressure rises, heart disease can become chronic. The lack of attention to bothersome episodes can lead to catastrophic events. But with the pressures surrounding us these days, what do we do? It's a good question, and it's a, it's a simple answer, but it's so hard to achieve. The simple answer is Dr. Wallace's simple list, beginning with... Sleep hygiene. Sleeping seven to eight hours a day. Exercise 20 to 30 minutes a day. Any kind of exercise. Avoiding lots of caffeine is helpful. Avoiding lots of alcohol is helpful. And it may be the last thing on the doctor's list, but it might just be the first thing you do to protect yourself. Prayer and meditation. Wisdom from a shade tree cardiologist who treats the outer problems knowing the value of inner peace.